Hey guys, my name is Jennifer and I am Genevieve Designs. Today is the last giveaway drawing for the Basically Amazing Enchanted Decorative Edge add-on. And how you entered to win was you left a comment in the last giveaway video underneath that video and you have to be a subscriber to my channel. So the last two backgrounds that were left were the light wood and the grungy wood. So I release two new backgrounds every two weeks and you vote on them and, and then those are the ones that I release. Well, these are the last two left. So this is what the Etsy listings look like. These, the, the grungy wood and the light wood, I don't know, there's something about them. And I think this happens every time. I just, every one of them seems to be my favorite. And I wish I could use every background in every album because I just love them so much. They're so good for being in the background of your albums. They're just perfect. So the grungy wood, this is what the Etsy listing looks like. And then that is the second photo in the listing. So you can see more of the background. And then here's the light wood. Um, Again, it's a listing photo, and the second photo has more, um, you know, a, bit, a better image of the background design. So today's uh, winners get to choose, um, well, actually, they don't have to choose because <laughs> I, you're actually going to get both. So today's winners getting both of these. So they're going to get the, both the grungy and the light. So two winners today, and they're going to get both. They don't have to choose, they get both. And so I've already, let's go ahead and do that part of the drawing. And then later I have, um, I, ha I want to show you, I want to show you some, uh, uh, maybe a detail that I've, I'm going through and finishing up the details, uh, all the little blank spaces and things off camera um, in the album that we're currently making, which I will link that playlist up here. I'm going through and finishing up uh, bits and pieces and I'll, I'll do a final flip through for you guys uh, when I'm finished. But I do want to show you a fun little thing that I did the other day uh, that I think you guys might like to see. So that'll be after the giveaway drawing. So I have the random YouTube comment picker. Let me scoot you in because I want you to be able to see in the glare of the, the light's kind of annoying. <laughs> I've already put the URL for the last video. Of the last giveaway video I've already pulled the comments and I'm gonna hit start and I, then I need to go check to make sure that you are a subscriber to my YouTube channel so if I hit start and then you don't see anything I'm not going to hit start again you know that's because the person wasn't subscribed to my YouTube channel so just bear with me sometimes um, there's no problem at all and the giveaway winners are subscribed to my channel and everything goes smooth. Other times it could take me 10 tries <laughs> to um, to get a winner. So I'm going to hit start and we'll see who comes up first. Okay, I need to pick another winner. And I'm going to hit start. Okay, I'm going to pick another okay congratulations to Debbie's journal dreams you are the first winner and you need to contact me via that special email I have linked down below um, to get the process rolling to claim your winnings and you have until I forgot to say that part you have until August 18th 2023 uh, to contact me via that special email. Okay, so now I am going to pick another winner. Hit pick another winner. I'm going to hit start. Well, congratulations. I have checked. You are a subscriber. Your name is... I'm going to totally mispronounce this, and I am extremely... Sorry, but Lagaya or Ligaya or Lagaya, Lagaya, Amboy. I don't know. I'm sorry. I am so sorry. I don't. I, I probably just made a mess of that name. But anyway, congratulations. <laughs> you are the second winner 
for this giveaway drawing and just contact me via that email that's linked down below and you have until August 18th, 2023 to contact me to claim your winnings. So congratulations and again, I do apologize for saying your name terrible. Okay, I'm gonna scoot back out. All right, so that is the last giveaway drawing for this basically amazing decorative edge add-on, the Enchanted Decorative Edge add-on. And um, wow, that was a lot. That We did that quick. Normally I do it once a month, but I was doing it every two weeks, you know, just to make sure to get all these background designs out to you guys. So yeah, congratulations to the winners. And oh, I am gonna do, I asked you guys if you wanted me to do like a, or if it would be fun to do like a buy one, get one. And I have, and I'm and and we're gonna do that. This it's but it's I have racked my brain to figure out how to do this because I've tried these particular background designs. There, it's it's a it's a, the files are big for whatever reason. These files are big, so I can't have both of these in one listing. No matter how I've tried to work it, I just cannot get them small enough in order to get them all in one listing because you, you have uh, limitations in Etsy. You know, you can only link five things in, or five files and then they can only be so big. And anyway, so I've been racking my brain, racking my brain, racking my brain, and I can't, I just can't work it out. So here's what I've decided to do. <laughs> I've decided that the best way to do this is for you guys uh, to go down, go to my Etsy shop and purchase both of these. Then you contact me through that purchase and then I will refund one of them. So it's kind of a, I won't get one, but it, there is a bit of a process. I just need to refund your money for that. Um, and you just need to make that purchase before midnight, um, 12 midnight Eastern Standard Time, August 18th, 2023. So you have a week. So what you need to do in order to get both of these, you need to purchase both and then contact me after you made your purchase and I will refund one of them. Um, a couple common questions I get asked uh, when I do things like this. Um, they don't have to be in the same purchase but they do have to be on the same account and they do have to be purchased within this week, within the week between the time this video goes public to midnight, August 18th, Eastern Standard Time. Okay, so you can purchase both in two separate purchases. Just contact me through one. Make sure you're purchasing them on the exact same account because a lot of you, believe it or not, have more than one account on Etsy and you may not even know that. So make sure that you make the purchase on the same account, or you can make the purchase on the same, you know, both of these on the same purchase, which was obviously gonna be the easiest way. Then contact me and I will refund your money as, as soon as I can. Um, if you leave me a note, you can leave me a note in your purchase, but a lot of times I don't see those. It just really depends on the traffic and the amount of purchases that are made. So it's best just to contact me. Um, through the Etsy messaging system, you know, the conversations and stuff. So, yeah, so you get both, you buy one, get one, right? You purchase both, and I'll refund one of them, and so you have both. So, for a week, um, I will have that promotion going, and it only applies, by the way, it only applies to the Basically Amazing Enchanted Decorative Edge add-on, Grungy Wood and Light Wood. It only applies to these two. I just thought it would be fun um, since these are the last two and these are really so good to have in, in your arsenal. I'm just saying. Okay, so there is that. So let's put all that aside. But I wanted to show you really quick a fun little thing that I did the other day. Um, let me scoot you in just a little. Okay, so this is one of the pages. So this page was actually blank uh, the last time you saw it. And I have matted it with some of the decorative, uh, some of the uh, paper collection, and um, it, it's beautiful. So before I actually glued it down, I made kind of a belly band. I used an embellishment here. This is one of the um, embellishments that's part of the paper collection. Isn't it pretty? I punched a hole here and here, 
and I strung uh, some string through it and it, I wrapped it all the way around. I didn't cut it or tape it. I just wrapped it all the way around and it moves like this. It can go back and forth. It's just kind of a silly, fun little, you know, a little interactive element. And I don't know if I'll be able to flip it over, but the string is back there still. Maybe I can, maybe you can see it if I do it like this. You see that string, right? So, and then, so this is fun, right? Let me take this out. So that, that's what it looks like without the insert there. Isn't that cute? I just thought it was adorable. So then the insert for this, I made a little booklet, like a little journal. And again, we've done this almost every time we make an album. I make a little journal with coffee stained paper. This actually was given to me by one of you guys, by one of you subscribers. I, I'm almost 100% certain it was at Metacon a few years ago. Oh my gosh. How many years ago was that? That's been a while. And I still have it. So it's dot grid and it's been coffee stained and I pulled it out of my stash just for this book. So that kind of, oh, those are tags. I think I know who sent this to me, who gave this to me. Um, you see that? There's tag images on there. That's so cool. I didn't notice that when I made the book. Oh, man. Okay. Well, anyway, um, if it's you, thank you. Leave me a comment. Um, I would love to, <laughs> to be reminded. Anyway, so I used it. I made a little book. I sewed, the, I sewed it together using the pamphlet stitch, three-hoe pamphlet stitch. Not a big deal. You guys have seen me do it a million times. And there is... So I used the... From the... Uh, photomat essentials I use the 5x7 photomat that um, doesn't have the black it has the just the white mat behind it and you cut the black line off folded it in half I cut some of the pattern paper down to go as the cover and again you can also uh, here's what it looks like without anything on it by the way without uh, matting it at all see so look how cool that looks right but you can also, these pages here, um, let me see if I can't find, you can, you know, obviously put, look, here's a 5x7 photo mat. You can obviously uh, cut the black off and put the 5x7 part, you know, the, with the photo mat, I mean the, um, the photo corners. You can obviously do that. Oh, where, where was this at? <laughs> but you can also take, this is a 4x6 photo mat, you can also take and put four by six photos on every page, a four by six photo mat on every page if you want it to. So that's kind of a fun idea as well. So I just kind of wanted to show that because I didn't think to do that prior to recording this video. I didn't think to add the photo mat. So yeah, I just wanted to share. So it goes in here. It's a little bit thicker, but uh, because this belly band is so loosey-goosey that um, it works out perfectly. And I just thought it was a cute little layout so i just kind of wanted to share that with you guys okay that is all i have for you uh, congratulations to the winners make sure to contact me before before august 18th uh to claim your winnings and don't forget to do the buy one get one again purchase both the enchanted decorative edge light wood and grungy wood and contact me and i will refund uh one of them for you so buy one get one all right, you guys, thank you so much for hanging out with me today, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.